messing around here this evening with uh, smoking some trout. And I'm also trying out something new that I got. I saw there's not a lot of videos online. For years, um, I've always used an external sealer like most people do. Whether it's Food Saver, I have a Cabela's model. But uh, the benefits of a chamber sealer is that not only do you get a tighter seal, you can use thicker bags and they're a heck of a lot cheaper. Those Food Saver bags, Cabela's brand, whatever they are, they have to, uh, to make little ribs in the end of them so that the air can come out and it's actually a downside to it is if you have wet meat fish fillets whatever you can eventually suck enough fluid into that thing to destroy it this machine here actually pressurizes the entire chamber and the bags don't have to have any ribs so consequently you can do soups you can force marinade stuff but i'm going to show you how this thing works here this is a backpack 100 series now i got the oil pump to it not that big of a deal setup's really easy it's like five minutes but it's a little bit quieter so i take my two fillets make sure the paper's over top of the ceiling board like so and this thing's already on it's set on 30 seconds by default it's a little bit longer but i want to make sure i get that tight seal so all we're going to do close that thing down take your hand off of it you can see everything's starting to pressurize up I'm really just totally impressed with this unit. Now they are a little bit pricey. I think this thing was $8.50, but you're gonna make your money up in bags really fast because this box here is a thousand eight by tens and you can get them in whatever size you want. The 100 series I think is 10 and a half inch width bag, but you can see you can go back here away. So if you can fit it in a 10 inch spot. Now here all at once, timer's up. I don't know how. Yep. That's all that air getting forced out. It's going to seal and open like magic. And you have these beautiful fillets ready to go right in the freezer. So, to me, I am going to use this thing. And if you're somebody that puts up a lot of meat in a year, I always had at least two or three bags where the seal would be a little bit off, whether it was an odd shaped item or just you'd come in there at the end of the year and some of your, your hard fought wild game meat is uh is shot i mean it's really i use it for trapping bait but if you're trying to eat it there's at least a few packs every year using an external sealer so i i would strongly consider when you're done with this thing there's a nice little arm that goes up here it uh it's really restaurant quality so it, me beating the crap out of this thing for it's going to last years and years and years they do tell you to change the oil after 20 hours but yeah, it's not that big of a deal. It's it's really simple. There's a couple screws in the back. They do include the oil with it. And I ordered that from a place called the Webstaurant Store. I'm fortunate that's local to me here being in Central PA. But they ship everywhere and they are fast. And they have great customer service. But the VAC Packet, the 100 series with the oil pump. I, I'm going to be able to use this thing to the point I hand this down to my kids. I have all certainty. So... Just an idea, if you're somebody that really puts up a lot of it and are kind of running into the same issues, it might be worth it to you to spend the money because in a year, I think those bags will easily make a dent in this thing. And I'm not planning on stopping hunting and fishing anytime soon, but I really like the quality. So 